Bitches, it's a misanthropic one, aka He Who Hungers, and I'm back up in this bitch for another rant. Please follow me and in the links in the description box below. Please like these videos that I produce, share them all over the internet. Y'all know the deal. Um, let's jump right into it. Um, I want to talk about the legendary rapper Too Short and um <laughs> This recent controversy that has him apologizing. Listen, uh, guys, I've said it once, and I'm gonna continue to keep saying it. I am sick and tired of people saying real shit and cucking up and apologizing. Um, but this is no surprise from Too Short. Uh, this is a dude who spent over 30 years rapping about bitches and hoes, and just a few years ago, I, I think about two about two, three years ago, maybe, something like that. Uh, Me Too got this brother shook, and um, he started talking about, oh, man, you know, you got to um, gotta be careful when you push up on, like, made a whole statement. It's like, come on, dude. <laughs> you pioneered majority of this Mac shit. I, I, no one's trying to hear that shit, all right? Now, yeah. He was on some video or some type of live, I, I believe, with um, the this rapper Sawidi. I think that's how you say her name. And uh, some comments came up um, when it came down to interracial relationships. And he said something to the effect of, um, you know, mixed mixed heritage women has have always been his favorite and. Um, he said, I don't think I've ever fallen in love with a woman that wasn't mixed. And he was saying you could take two of the ugliest people from separate races and they'll they'll create a beautiful baby. I mean, <laughs> why are people having to to apologize for their preference? That's essentially his preference he's not putting nobody down he's not saying you know y'all are ugly or x is ugly or this and that he's he's talking about his preference and he was referencing the bay area as well that um well that's what him and saweetie were talking about saying that there's like you know there's mixed people out there so that's what he he's probably used to um so you know they're calling him they're saying that he made cholerist colorist excuse me colorist quote unquote colorist remarks now colorist is a term that i don't even subscribe to i don't buy into it if you're going to say colorist just say racist because it, it's essentially the same thing that's what these people are trying to say but you know all these people like to come up with new fucking words um especially colorist because th that's used against um black people when um they don't want to say they don't want to call another black person racist because the new definition of racist includes power plus prejudice it, it's just a whole like <sighs> hodgepodge of bullshit just say racist it's easy we have a word for judging people based off of race that's what it is all right um cut the cut the you know sjw bs that's number one uh but yeah do i view it as any type of uh bashing no but again you know he has to appeal he has to appeal to a lot of uh bitches sensitivities now and and oh no i'm, I'm so sorry i'm so why it's a preference get over it you know what i mean no one was hurt <laughs> jesus christ <sighs> fuck my head hurts um yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much done. Uh, you know, a lot of people wonder why I say I'm kind of done with rap. It's because of shit like this. You know what I mean? 
Like, I'm so sick and tired of people cucking up. Stop apologizing when you say real shit. Nobody's feelings were hurt, and if anybody's feelings were hurt, they need thicker skin. Um, that's it. Everybody else, y'all know the deal. Leave your love, leave your hate, most of all, subscribe. Um, and, uh, you know, like and share the video. That's it. Peace, bitches.